Ariel Hawani post fight at UFC 162 alongside Mark Munoz, who just defeated Tim Boach in very dominant fashion. And Mark, congratulations on a big win. And you were just telling me off camera that you were hitting Tim with everything. Were you surprised he didn't quit? Yeah, I was hitting him so hard. I even think I did something to my hand. I hit him so hard, but um, no, nah, you know, he he's a tough opponent, man. He's very resilient. You know, I remember watching his fight against Yushin, and he was just, you know, he was very resilient, very durable. So I knew I had to really, really pour it on him, and I was hitting him so hard. I really was, but, you know, that's just a testament of who he is. He's very tough. When do you think you injured your hand? I think in the third round because I went to go hit him, and boom, I hit him, and I felt a sharp pain in it. And I switched sides and I started hitting him with my left, with my left hand. So, um, yeah, I think it was towards the middle of the third round. You think it's broken? Uh, you know, I hope not. I hope not. But, you know, you we'll were, see. You had those amazing uh, punches at the end of the fight when you were trying to jump kind of over him through his guard. I was trying, man. I was trying to knock him out. I was trying. We haven't seen that, that Mark Munoz. And you look yeah. to be in amazing shape. Obviously, yeah. you talked about it. Did the weight cut, did all the weight that you lost, did that affect you at all in there? No, it didn't affect me at all. I lost 76 pounds total. Um, but I lost, um, I lost actually 61 pounds um, just with diet and exercise. And no GM, I mean, no testosterone, no hormones, no growth hormone, no nothing. I did supplements all the way into the middle of my camp, and I was eating so good that I took away the supplements. So um, I was just eating clean food, paleo diet that uh, Todd Norman and um, Sun Fair, Carl Farrow, uh, actually put together for me, and Sam Calavita and, um, and Dave Jackson actually put together for me as well. So, you know, I, I, I got a lot of good people around me, and I'm going to keep them around me, man. You know, what's so interesting about this fight was that you were obviously on the same card as Chris Wyman, and every time they were trying to build up Chris, they were almost kind of putting you down as well. Did you hear that stuff, and did it give you motivation going into this fight? You know what? I didn't hear that. I, I don't pay attention to that too much. Um, but now that I heard it, yeah, it kind of kind of puts a, kind of hits a switch in me. Um, but, but you know, I, I, wasn't, I wasn't myself in that fight, and, you know, I'll chalk it up as a loss, but a learning experience. You know, and um, I'm back, and um, I'll be more than happy to fight him again. You are back in a big way, my friend. Congratulations on the win. Thank you. Thank you so much, Aaron.